Button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right yo 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 this game's a graphics we are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you and today we are going to be installing a graphic mod called V Reloaded all right this one right here is created by Zed Shout out to the creator. We are on the creator's Patreon right now. This is the creator's Patreon page. What you want to do is come to the creator's Patreon. And in order to get the reloaded, you want to go ahead and pledge for the gold tier. Okay, this is the gold tier right here where it says V Reloaded. Now, if you check out the other tiers as well, there's one more tier above that that's called the Platinum. And you will be able to get the Quant V and Natural Vision Evolved. Um pack with that as well um it's not the whole pack it's like a reshade preset for quant v and mve as well as v reloaded okay so uh feel free to check out any one of uh, these tiers which is the gold tier or the platinum tier okay so after you have um after you have uh went ahead and chose a tier uh either gold or platinum um, if you look at the post, the very first, very first post you will see will be for the March early access. Or whenever that you're watching this video, you should see the latest early access for the download of V Reloaded. You will have to go ahead and join the creator's Discord in order to get the download link. Okay? So everything is explained on the post once you have joined this creator's Patreon. Alright? So once you have joined it and went down to the Discord and have downloaded it, it should look something like this on my left hand side. I have one folder that says V Reloaded Early Access March 2022. On my right hand side I have my Grand Theft Auto 5 directory opened up. At this point what you want to do is have a mods folder. So if you don't have one go ahead and create a new folder and name it mods all in low caps. All right. Once you have that created what you want to do is open up your open 4. I have my open four open up right here on my right hand side as you can see before we go any further always make sure that you have your edit mode turned on it's this little button right here once you have your edit mode turned on let's go back over to our downloads and open up the v reloaded folder inside that folder is going to be two options single player and 5m for today's tutorial we're only doing the single player package okay so open up the v reloaded single player package inside that folder we are going to have four more folders in the readme let's go ahead and start off with the first folder right here which is v reloaded graphics installer let's open this one up inside the v reloaded graphics installer there's going to be a oiv package what we want to do with this is just select it drag and drop it over here to our open four then the package installer window should open up from this point we want to select install select the mods folder that you just created and then select install confirm installation once that has been done you can exit out of that package installer window go back over to your download select the back arrow and let's continue down the list let's go ahead and uh, select this right here which is number two is the emb setup let's go ahead and open up that folder inside that folder we want to highlight everything inside the folder okay just like how i have everything here highlighted you want to highlight everything and you want to drag and drop it right over here into your grand theft Auto 5 directory you could you could do that by uh dragging and dropping it into your open four or you could just go ahead and bring back up your grand theft Auto 5 directory and take everything from the emb setup folder and drag and drop it right here into your Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. I already have it as you can see. Now let's go back over to our downloads. Select the back arrow. Now we want to go to the next folder, which is number three. It's going to be the reshade setup. Inside this folder is going to have um, our folder for our reshade shader shaders and, and our textures as well. 
Now from this point, you will need to have reshade installed already in order to install this part right here, okay? I will leave a link down in the description to a video showing you how to install reshade if you don't have it installed already, okay? Now this is not a requirement. This is only optional if you would like to have reshade installed, okay? So if you have reshade installed, what we're gonna do is go ahead and grab everything inside of this reshade setup folder and we are going to drag and drop everything over here to our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. Once that is dragged and dropped, let's go back to our downloads, select the back arrow to go back. Now let's go over the optional extras, okay? These are all optionals. Let's open up this folder, it's the fourth folder. Inside this folder of optional extras, first one they have is brighter emergency lights. And if you open up this folder, you will see that there is a OIV file, which is uh, easy installation. All right, select the back arrow. The next folder is loading screens. Okay, this is loading screens like when you turn on the game and you see the loading screens, this will give you V reloaded loading screens. All right, and if you select this, which is number three, is the Valmetric street lights. All right, to give you a little bit of brighter lights on the streets. Um, and then the last one is, uh, well, not the last one, but the fourth one is loading screen music. Then the fifth one is optionals. Okay, if we go inside this fifth folder, it'll, it will have three folders. Inside each folder will have um, links to uh, each of these folders. Okay, so the first one is real California architecture that adds um, a bit of Los Angeles, California to the game. Um, it actually changes up the freeways and um, a, a lot of things around uh, the map. Okay, so if you open up this folder, it's going to have a link that will lead you to the download page. And it will be the same thing for the next one, which is Skynet. That's also a, um, a graphic enhancer. And uh, you also have World of Variety. All right. So all of these all have links inside of them, as you can see. All right, so we are all done installing V Reloaded. Let's go ahead and minimize any windows we might have open and run the game. All right, now as, uh, as you turn on the game or when you uh, enter into the game, you should see a lot more like different effects, especially like the sky. Um, at daytime, I have it on noon right now and uh, extra sunny. As you can see, we got uh, some nice cloud action going on up there in the sky. Um, let's get a nice little bird's eye view real quick. Going up. So everything looks good right now. Also, uh, we still have that uh, reshape preset. So let's go ahead and um, check that out as well. But before we do that, let's head to the beach. And let's get a nice car to do that in. Alright, this will work. Cool. All right, so let's go ahead and bring this down to the beach. All right, now that we are at the beach, we can go ahead and drop the top. <laughs> go ahead and drop the sunroof back. All right, let's get a little bit closer to this water. This is another thing I noticed the water looks a lot darker than the normal, right? Let's go over some. There you go. So as you can see the water is a lot more darker than uh than the normal. Looks pretty good, looks pretty good. You definitely want to have um your uh, water quality or your water texture on high quality. All right, we got a lot of the foam that comes when the water rushes up on the beach, on the sand. Looking 
good, looking good. All right, let's go ahead and check out the uh, sand out here also. Oh, yeah, sand looks good also. And I don't even have my texture on complete high. I think I think I just have it. Nope, actually I do have my texture on high. Let me check. Um, go into graphics. Way down. Yep, my texture quality is on high. My shader quality is on normal. Shadow quality very high. Reflection quality is normal as well. So it looks good during the daytime. Let's see how it looks at nighttime. So everybody can see. It's real dark out there. Let's go back to uh, noon and uh, open up these presets. By opening up reshade. And um, what you want to do is the mouse select this up here. I am on V Reloaded right now. So what I'm going to do is put it on the reshade preset. All right. So this is the reshade preset right here. We were already on v, v Reloaded preset. But this is my reshade preset. All right. Wow, that guy is just moving stuff over over there. Okay. All right. So in here, let's go ahead and go to the top bar right here and scroll down to you see vreloaded.any and double click it and you will see everything start to change as you see the whole um, everything got brighter in the background as I changed that preset and also feel free to uh, check out the rest of these um, presets also well not presets but little options that you might like it might enhance the picture for you like this one right here makes a, it, it a little blurry it's a little bit of blur to it so there's there's a lot of uh, these options down here that you could try out that you might like so once you have done that go ahead and uh, just select escape to escape out of uh, reshade and you're all good to go yo all right well I'm gonna let uh, Franklin go ahead and chill here at the beach man and enjoy this nice dark water dark blue water right it's like navy blue yo <laughs> but if um, y'all enjoyed this video or if it helped y'all out to install it feel free to smash that like button for me definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with your friends that are in the modding GTA 5 y'all this game's graphics me big bowling ass Frank we are out of here until next time yo I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.